My name is Maisha Taylor. I'm a mom of three. I have a 15-year-old girl and I have two six-year-old uh, twin girls. They are wonderful. Um, they're very active in the community. Today in Santa Clara County, children are faced with a growing number of challenges as their parents struggle with the rising cost of living. The growing tech industry, combined with Santa Clara County's low inventory of multifamily units, creates a strain on children, particularly in moderate to low-income communities whose parents are faced with the rising cost of housing. The rising costs cut into their ability to cover costs of essentials such as food, clothing, and transportation. When I became a parent, it was a time of joy and it was a time of fear. Now I was in a position to be a mother, to provide everything for my child. Parents are a child's first and most important support, and children are far more likely to succeed if families are strong, stable, and resilient. My role as a community worker uh, began with me working with uh, families with children zero to five years old, serving the Sunnyvale community uh, with anything that uh, would be needed as far as food, uh, supplying them with resources on uh, housing, rental assistance. Some of our families can't pay their PG&E bills, so just helping families navigate resources to make their load with fueling a family financial a little bit easier. This year, First Five is investing over 18 million in Santa Clara County to address this strain and to promote access to resources, ensuring children's success in school and life. So the FRC was also a place where I learned about self-care. And that's something that I think across the board, parents need to hone in on is that we cannot take care of our children unless we're taking care of ourselves. So I learned about mindfulness at the FRC. I learned about breathing, I learned about planning, I learned about food prep. To many families in Santa Clara County, resources are inaccessible, especially to those who need them the most. In addition, many don't believe they qualify for the support. Um, there are plenty of families that were coming through the uh, Family Resource Centers that really had no answers to how to provide best for their families. I think that this is a population that you may overlook when you visit the Silicon Valley. Uh, we're known for having the top tech companies. We're known people come from all over the world to experience the Silicon Valley, but behind all of the big buildings are these neighborhoods. Over 23 first five FRCs are the bridge to critical resources families rely on during their time of need. My role as a community worker uh, began with me working with uh, families with children zero to five years old, serving the Sunnyvale community uh, with anything that uh, would be needed as far as food, uh, supplying them with resources on uh, housing, rental assistance. Some of our families can't pay their PG&E bills, so just helping families navigate resources to make their load with fueling a family financial a little bit easier. The goal of the FRCs is to connect families to their neighbors, schools, and communities with central focus on their children's needs. The goal of the FRC is to give parents the tools to be the best parents that they can be, that they want to be, and they meet you where you are to make that possible, and I appreciated that. Nearly a third of the FRC staff are made up of community members who have participated in the FRC services and are now giving back to their community. FRCs mobilize critical services and resources to the appropriate neighborhoods, promoting family stability, self-sufficiency, and overall well-being. 